Bunch. We got three on the back. Three on the back. Fall back. Fall back. Fall back. Watch your mark, Leader. trouble. Well, you know the score, Reese. We've got nothing but sunshine and palm trees here in L.A. Who could have any trouble? It was bad, Cat. It was a bloodbath. The bots ate us alive. Kachowski and Weaver? They didn't make it. All right, people. We've got a lot of work to do to keep the robots out of Sector 3. Jensen just left to take out the bridge heading east from Sector 7. That should slow them down. Parker, what's the status on today's recon? Got it right here, Connor. I've targeted three sites for more recon. Fine. Let's get the scouts out ASAP. Sir, has this individual been cleared by security? Yeah. The bots are starting to look more and more like us every day. Hey, couldn't he be one of the prototypes for a new model or something? Relax, Kyle. Our new soldier here checks out. I even had him run past one of the new canine units. I've decided to assign him as a field op to the command team. Major Catherine Parker, good to have you aboard. This is Dr. Hanover, our chief technician. You could call me Bill. And our young skeptic here is Kyle Reese, we think. Yeah, well, you can't be too careful around here. Anyways, welcome aboard. Now that we're all introduced, are you ready for some action? Yes, sir. Good. Parker, give him the details on one of those recon missions. Right. The bots have a new complex in Sector 4. Surveillance has shown convoys moving in and out of there over the last two days. We need more information. The bots have something important going on there. We need to know about it. Sounds straightforward enough. It should be. You'll take a jeep through the hills park a short distance from the complex, which will be west of your position. You shouldn't hit heavy opposition until you're inside. Once in, conduct a standard search of the facility, then return to base. HQ, come in. Connor here. What's your status? I've made it back to the Jeep. Tell Parker her recon on the complex was half right. Sir, the bots have got a nuclear missile inside. It's bigger than any I've seen before. I'll give a full report when I get back, but right now I need a way out of here. It looks like the eastern route has been cut off. How's the road to the west look? Not good, but it's your only way out now. It heads west through the hills and then cuts south. Recon indicates the road is pretty well defended, but it will definitely bring you back. All right, then. I'd better get going. See you at base. So can you fix it or not? It's a very sophisticated particle energy weapon, Major. Not a damn battering ram. Have it ready before my next field off. Here you go, Doc. Here's the hollow unit. Oh, very good. Hey, man. Welcome back. It's good to see you alive, soldier. I know getting out of there wasn't easy. Tell me more about the missile. What kind is it? 
It's definitely one of ours, but much larger than the ones I'm familiar with. Its serial number started with the word Hades. Ah, oh, the Hades missile. Developed as a test missile during the 90s to offset the bigger Russian model. The U.S. developed the Hades as a deterrent. It's a city killer, John. The biggest nuke ever made. They say it can turn a city to dust. So, why didn't Skynet use Hades before? When Skynet attacked, it could only launch the missiles that were online at the time. The Hades never went into production. I suspect the robots only recently recovered this one. No doubt they plan to use it. Agreed. And it won't be like the last time. Just one Hades will vaporize the entire city. There'll be nothing left. No rubble. No life. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. The recon camp didn't appear to be the launch site. No, no, it's, it's too close. They'll probably launch from outside the city to maximize the warhead's yield. This situation takes top priority, people. We don't know how much time we've got, but the missile must be eliminated. Doctor, what are our options? Unfortunately, I've told you everything I know. We need more information on Haiti. If I had detailed schematics, we might be able to disable it before it's launched. Cyberdyne has as much data on our nukes as anyone. They set up Skynet for the government. It's a good bet their records would have something on Haiti. Parker's right. The Cyberdyne research and data building downtown is where they first put Skynet online for testing. Everything we need to know would be there. Then that's where I'm headed, Connor. I'm not letting those damn robots nuke us again. The Cyberdyne building is in dangerous territory. Once you're in the building, head for the basement. The testing facility is most likely underground. You'll hear from me once I'm inside. Good luck, soldier. Bay, this is Jensen. I've got our boy. I'll be copy, Jensen. Bring him home. But I'm tired of hanging around the base. I want to go on a mission. I want to make a difference against Skynet. We've been over this before, Kyle, and my decision stands. I promise you, you'll get your chance to make a difference. Tell Sanchez she has until nightfall to evacuate her squad, and that means everyone this time. We don't need any more dead heroes. Yes, sir. Hey, you look a lot more comfortable than you did on the top of that roof. What the hell happened out there? The data wasn't there, sir. It's been moved. I was sure happy to see Jensen. Where'd you get the HK? Bill modified one so we can fly it. That baby sure can move. That rescue is a fine piece of work, Jensen. But we can't afford distractions, people. We've got to focus on neutralizing the Hades. I need a solution, and I need it now. I recommend an all-out offensive on the missile base. Hit them fast and hit them hard. Everything we've got. Casualties will be high. We've got a strike before Skynet can launch. Actually, Major, we may have an alternative. I ran across some interesting stuff on the Cyberdyne system. One file concerned a missile test silo, and another related to a Hades data upload to the USS Las Cruces. Uh, I think the Las Cruces was the Navy's latest nuclear sub that stopped in L.A. before the war. If we can locate it, the Hades data should be on board. You're correct, Tom. The sub was docked at the Southeast Harbor. And that's our next move. Parker, what's the latest recon on the harbor? Recon reports the new T-600 series is prevalent in that area. That sector's taken some pretty heavy hits. Let's hope that the Las Cruces is still intact. Nothing I can't handle, Major. That's what I like to hear, soldier. Radio back when you reach the sub, and keep alert. The T-600s are covered in latex, so while they don't look human up close, you can be fooled from a distance. Come in. Connor here, what's wrong? 
The damn robots have sunk the sub. Repeat, the robots have sunk the sub. I've got the data, but now I'm trapped in here. You've got to get out of there, Filter. That data's our only hope. The sub's starting to take on water, but I'll find my way out of here somehow. You can count on it. I'll contact you again when I'm out. Get moving, Filter. It doesn't sound like you have much time. On or out. Base, I'm out of the sub and safe for now. Once I'm out of this sewer, I'll return to the jeep. HQ, I've reached the jeep and I'm heading back to base. Make it quick. We just got word the Terminators are moving the nuke on a convoy. We need to look at that data now. They're moving it to the test silo I read about at Cyberdome. They're going to launch today. I've got to intercept that convoy. When did it leave? About 45 minutes ago. Based on the coordinates you got from Cyberdyne, the test silo is located in the desert to the east. Then they'd have to take Route 91. How far is that from me? Not too far. There's a juncture east of your position. I'm going after it, sir. It's time to put this one to bed. Good luck. Stopping that convoy could be our last chance if they plan to launch today. Stay alert, soldier. The sun's coming up and you'll be an easy target in the daylight. Bad news, people. A convoy made it to the silo and the Terminators are prepping the Hades for launch. It's my fault, sir. That convoy should have never gotten through. Let's deal with the present situation. At least you got back here alive with the missile data. Hand over any progress. I've only had the data 15 minutes, Connor. Nothing yet. Time is a lost luxury, Doctor. We're facing a nuclear strike within the hour. Then there's no time to formulate a plan to disable the missile. Our best chance is to get to the silo and override the target coordinates. You mean give the missile a different target? Exactly. If someone can reach the launch controls, they can insert a harmless target zone, perhaps someplace in the Pacific. All right, Bill. But we've got to move now. Volunteers! I'll go. I'll sign a big payback. I'll do respect, Major. This is my job. Sir, give me the HK and I can reach the silo in a half hour. Sorry, Major. I need you here. This is our only shot. Get in the air, soldier. Hanover will radio the target codes to you when you get there. Yes, sir. According to your coordinates, the silo is in the desert to the east. Good luck. Base, I've just landed at the silo. Does Hanover have those new target codes? Affirmative. He just finished them. You'll have to get to the launch controls to load them. Our new ground zero is in the Pacific. One last thing, and this is important. You'll have to quickly launch the Hades yourself after you've loaded the new target zone, or the robots will detect the change and reset their original target. Any idea where the controls are? You'll have to discover them on your own, soldier. We're sending Hanover's target codes now. Good luck. You're our last hope. 